your was good guys so we're back at it again with another video so right now we're heading to home depot to go get some materials for something for the g you want you want to show them the fucking x marks the spot oh bullshit. That, that bullshit though yeah can i see oh yeah right above our house so you know they're targeting our house oh no but yeah we're on our way to home depot right now and we might stop by to go see uh g37 and uh a 3 Eighty-nine. Right. Oh, I think it's three eighteen. No, fuck are they looking at? They're not gonna. They don't want to see the fucking road. Yeah, they want to see a bridge. All right. So we'll get back to you guys when we get there. All right, guys. My brother can fucking record properly because his dumbass don't know how to do shit. He do a duck build type spoiler on his car. Now we're gonna do it the ghetto ass way and do it with fiberglass and car. It's just not recording. Is it really not? Can they hear me? Is it recording? It's recording. It's recording? Yo, is it recording or it not? It is recording. Oh, okay. So we're on our way to Home Depot because he doesn't know what to say. Because we're going to attempt to figure out how he can do this. We're at our local Home Depot. About to find some shit. So stay tuned. So, nah, what that is was... this? Oh, it's a spray shield. Okay. Not this. This you can easily cut though. That's the thing. Right? Well, we need... if we can get to, if we can find the moving boxes, the moving box. Okay, so. No, but that's, yeah. our, that's our best bet though. Anyway. So we're going to like attempt to do this with like fiberglass and cardboard as much as this possible. trial one. So yeah, trial one. So we're going to try to find the bondo. And the well, we don't need one. Well, well, to smooth it out. Yeah, I have that. Yeah, so we need okay. So fiberglass, just cardboard. Yeah, thanks, Yo, thanks. shout out to the new subscriber, bro. Yeah, yeah, this yeah, this is know, lit. Anyway, he didn't get carried off. See, this is what I'm talking about. We can use like it's this whole huge cost. piece, but yeah, but you're spending three dollars and you can use a whole thing if you mess up multiple times. See, so you, you see where I'm going with this? Oops, a two, what is that? Two thirty-eight. Like, look, you see, we can use like one no, not, whole piece. I'm not talking about that. Though. The, what do you mean? What do you mean? You get jagged ends. That's what I said. You get. I mean. Yeah, that's what I said. You get How about that? So, or do you want to go get a whole bunch of those 58 cents pieces? Yo, bro. I think. You gotta do this on a budget. Do you want to do this? Or we, if you mess up, because this is pretty thick, it'll hold its shape. This will hold its shape. If we, as long as we don't bend this right here. It'll hold the shape. No, we gotta cut this. I understand. We gotta. I'm talking about this line right here. Oh no, that's gonna be the problem though. How? All right. Well, while this guy figures this out, I'm gonna tell you guys a little something. Uh, we went. A, I went a little bit overboard, and I spent two grand on snap-on tools. I don't know how well that's gonna work out, but I spent two grand that I should have saved on snap-on tools, so we could break more things. So, just wanted to get that out there. I don't know what else we're gonna do, but, you know, we need tools and half of our stuff breaks without warranty. This Put that down, we're not, we're not buying this for this stuff. This looks like the quality. This is quality. Quality, all right, can we find this thing? All right. What else they got? What do you, what do you think, this? I mean, they got these, which are more than anything. All right, guys, so we found what we're gonna use. We got like these little, uh, what do you call this? I guess that's what it is right there. Cut out Edging, yeah. like for painters. So we're gonna do is we're gonna mock this up. We got four just in case we'll be mess up or if we need to add or like do the size or anything like that. But I think this is how we're gonna. All right, guys. So we ended up going to Walmart and I didn't record it, but I ended up getting two new wipers for the cord, and I got two, you know, air fresheners because you gotta stay, you know, black ice fresh. And then I got some de icer because you know here in the North Pole, everything freezes. So I don't know. I guess we're gonna go try to mock it, mock the uh, G up. So I'll probably do this in like when I have downtime or something. But you know, I'll continue it after I go in the backyard and I figure out what we're gonna do. I think Kelvin's in the backyard right now. So let's go see. All right, guys. So a little bit of an update on what we're doing right now. Uh, kind of. I wasn't really recording because I was trying to get it done, but. We figured out how we're gonna use the two boards. This is gonna be the bottom shelf piece. 
that's gonna be the top you do by like you know shelves gonna be the top shelf so yeah this is gonna be obviously like that and when we do this when we cut it we're gonna line it up with right here the end of the trunk on both sides so like when you look at it it like comes out in an angle like this instead of it coming out straight so right now we're just gonna clean the trunk out we're gonna put some tape on it so you can mock it up and we're not gonna fiberglass it in this video because it's just gonna take you know it's gonna it'll be, be it'll yeah it'll be way too long so we're gonna mock it up get it done we're gonna tape it up so we can show you how guys how it's gonna look and we actually we're gonna spray foam the inside of it because we're gonna like just use the cardboard of like an outer like exo exoskeleton haven't used that word in months I mean, years, years probably anyway we're gonna use uh, like a, a little uh exoskeleton that way we can when we put the foam inside it'll be like as tightly packed as possible that way when we put the fiberglass it'll come out smooth instead of like all the crinkles that are on the cardboard itself so I do my work on fiberglass. yeah and then obviously next video we're gonna fiberglass it so we're gonna get, get this mocked up back and then i'll you know pick back up when we got it mocked up so you can see show you guys how it's gonna look and i think kelvin wants to go look we got we got a whole case of spray yeah spray foam so we're, we're gonna do that let it Shout sit that way we can get it done because at least with the spray foam if we need to shave it off um you know to make it fit properly or whatnot we can always do that so yeah all right guys so i don't know if this does any justice but i know like don't yell at us just yet the way we got this hacked up i told you this is a hack channel but if you see what i mean this line right here we're gonna trim like the edges off where we're gonna come straight up and that line right there so like right there and then whatever extra like you see how this we have this cardboard we're gonna put it on the side and create a panel so from the side tell me this doesn't look lit yo it looks so lit it really does it truly it really does insane so that's all I have to say. Alright, so what's the plan now? Are we gonna cut this in angles? Like Um, hold on. I don't know if we should do you want it to be a little, a little bit higher. Cause I, I think hold on hold on wait. I think it looks fine right there. Right? I don't know. We'll figure this out when we pick it up. Yeah. All right, guys. So I told you we'd pick it up when we got back done. So kind of got it all taped off and whatnot. How we going to do it? So let's cut it off and see how this will look. Don't yell at me in the comments because I don't know if I'm using the right knife or not. Oh yeah, uh, yeah. Follows the body. Right, come over here so, I, so they can see, and yeah, so I can see. Can you see right? Yeah, but what are they gonna see? Yeah, no, they Crouch see. down so they can see. I don't know if they can see. This is for them, so they can be entertained. Watch me scratch the damn paint. Yo guys, please take a mind. It's the first time I'm doing this. Custom fab at its finest. Custom fab. A custom brake, one of them too. Custom body work. Yeah, that makes, it looks about right, I think. I think that looks about right. Then, This one, this one, that we're gonna have to cut out. No, but this you lift up the trunk for. Yeah, it's gonna go so, on yeah, the side here. Yeah, is he, is he even recording? Yeah, it's recording. Bro, you gotta keep it like centered on that. I'll, anyway, back to this side. Let's see if you get this side up. He needs to come on this side, let's see, or do something. Yeah. 
Come on this side. Come on the other side. Come on the other side. Quick. Okay, guys. So currently, he's cutting off the. What do you mean? Like, apparently, I am. I said currently. Current. Oh, you currently. Yeah. Uh, anyway, somehow it looks from that side since I already cut this side off. Oh, I'm not done. What? I'm holding the shape? Nah, I forgot to put tape on the little handle. Anyway, so. Oh. We're taking it off right now. Oh, you! I know you just slipped and you just saved it. Anyway, uh, so we're, we're obviously going to take it off right now, but we're going to, at least so you guys, you know, don't get mad at us. We're going to throw it on some, you know, what is it called? Uh, foam? Yeah, we're going to foam the inside. Let's see if it's going to... Yeah, so we can get it to the place. Yeah. Because we're not going to let you guys go without seeing us throw some foam on it. You know, using a Speedway card. There's a cutting device. There's somebody over here doesn't want his car to get scratched. Yeah, because we don't know if this is going to stay in. Don't. Damn, he has foams. You need some foam inside. All right. All right, so we're going to go put this inside. He's going to go clean the car. All right, guys. So we told you we'd give you a little, like, spray foam detail type thing. We got this right here. I don't even know where we got this from, but we have a whole bunch of can cans of these. Where? A box. You got a whole box. So it's going to go ahead start spraying, I guess. If it'll spray, is it frozen? Is it frozen? You got to come out. Come on, what the hell did, did you do? That's bad. Why is it doing that? You need a new can. Yeah, we need a new can. That's gonna work. All right, guys, we'll, we'll find a new can real quick. Man, slow. You gotta shake it. Anyway, when we figure this out, we'll pick it back up. All right, guys. So this is how it's looking now. This whole bunch of foam wasted. Like, how many cans do we use? Like six, seven? Put it at seven. Like seven cans of foam to fill this whole thing up. So this is where we're gonna end it, you know, for this video, because obviously we gotta let it dry for like at least 24 to 48 hours, maybe like 36. Yeah, 36 hours is all good. And then obviously, when it dries, we'll try to take off the cardboard and smooth it out, mock it back on the car so if like, we need to add foam or like smooth it out or what, what have you. Because the foam is gonna act like a base and we're just gonna put five glass over it. But that's obviously gonna be the next video. So if you guys enjoyed, the like, wanna leave a comment, leave a comment, you know, hit that subscribe button. It's like somewhere down there, like right here, down there somewhere. So yeah.
in, the, in our basement right now. So, you know, do those things, helps out. We're trying to do more entertaining stuff for you guys. And then obviously this is, this is one of them. And then probably tomorrow when this dries, we're gonna try to sand this down. I got the wipers and stuff to put on my car. I gotta clean it up or not. So, hope you guys enjoyed. Like, comment, subscribe. Stay tuned for the next one.